A welcome everybody to episode 52 with uh, Ariel Blue in Dinkum. Let's go. Oh, I have things to deliver. I probably have a pocket full of... No, I don't have a pocket full of resources. Oh, look at a bunch of stuff I need to put away. Let's, uh, let's put those away. Try and get our heads together. I may or may not have been planning. I can't remember what I was doing last episode. It's only two days too. Man head like a sieve. Let's pop everything away, find out where we're at, pick up where we left off, make sure we got everything going good. I've got a, a ruby to go, not a ruby, an opal to go. Ah, uh, I do have poop. Poop to go. Do, do, do. No seeds? Nope. I have, I have different things that need to go underground underground in the underground box i know what i'm trying to say man just not doing the words my goodness all right looks like i missed my rocks my nails and they missed my hot rock over there let's grab that all right that's right i wanted to go into the mines because because i had to i have gone into the mines i know because i had to buy a thing all right, I have 38 iron bars, I have 37 tin bars, and I have 30 copper bars, and I have a bunch of different planks. I have seeds I need to plant. Um, it's going to drive me just a tiny bit crazy. And didn't I have rock paths to build? I did. Where's my concrete? Put the seeds out of there. All right, so I needed to have six rock paths for the um, brick paths. Brick paths. Yeah. All right, that'll do me. So I needed six brick paths for the garden, the public garden. And then I needed stairs. I know, and I was thinking around the museum. One of you suggested um, cement or cement. I don't know if I want cement. It looks nice and smooth though. I was hoping for marble of some kind. I know that looks that looks so gorgeous. I don't know what I want to put around there. We should put that around like um, Franklin's hut. <laughs> All right, and that's right. So one of the suggestions was I hadn't even thought of it. Was I need paths need to be double wide, and um well lit. And I haven't been doing the lighting at all. But then again, that comes under um. Home, home improvements. Oops, I think I just went a little bit overboard with those. Let's grab some more brick paths. You know, I might just build a hundred of them. It's not going to be enough, but it'll be a really good start. Now, I'm thinking some really pretty fences would be nice as well and instead of just the just the gumwood fences which I like I'm thinking maybe we should do some of these in around the town as well but where I'm getting I'm straying into town improvements when I should be focusing on my last uh, I know I need to go right down how many it is 904 it is Tuesday well, let's grab this I think I've got watering to do as well so yeah, so paths need to be double wide and they need to be well lit and I know, I shouldn't try and shortcut at that late stage and they should be fenced I think was the other thing so um, we should do that it's Tuesday, I'm not sure if rain is open today she might not be she has a, a day off every now and then smart girl, I should do well to follow her example alrighty 2.82 kilos, 50 grams worth of rubies. Oh, and we were thinking of going to Franklin. So I want to finish off the last of my animal enclosures. Um, I got a suggestion just this morning in this morning's comments for my next three chicken names. So now I need three chickens to, ooh, I need to do these, to, um, to do. Alrighty, I might have a look at my chores as well. We might just get those out of the way. 
an alpha eye. Wow, you get them from alpha devils. I need to go kill a few more of those because I've never got one. And I want to see what it looks like. I, I know that sounded really bad. <laughs> um, oh dear. How are we off for, um, for our little... Hey, how you doing? I know, I've got to work on my relationship with Malvin. I'm not ready to yet. Some things come out hard and functional, some come out soft and comfortable. I can't control what comes out, I just go with the grain. Ah, <laughs> Melvin! <laughs> That's terrible, Melvin. Thread space. I know, I also want to go on clothes shopping sprees. We're not doing that yet. I'm trying to be good. Hey, Fletch. Hey, Ariel Blue. What can I do for you? Uh, actually, never mind. I just... I, I just remembered I should be trying to pay off this town debt and I have no excuse not to. Yeah, let's um let's clear that debt. One, three, five, six, two, zero, confirm. That is so cool. I know I want there to be more buildings to build, but I don't think there are. I think we've actually got I think Sally was the latest one to be able to move in. Because it's, it's 90% of the fun for me is, is actually having people move into the town. Um, I know, that's terrible. Hey Rain, uh, let's see what her hours are. Like I said, I think she's off on Tuesdays. No, she's not open till 11. She, she's found a butterfly. Actually, I don't think I've caught that butterfly yet. Hi Rain, do I have a net? Let's go see what butterfly this is because I don't recognise it. I know, we are not pickaxing the butterfly, Ariel. A monarch. I think that might be new. Ooh, and I, I think we've got this one already, but we'll grab it anyway. Are you Ulysses? We, we might not got that one. Let's go and see. I don't know, sometimes the butterflies come to you. Uh, well, I have a donation. Oh man, I have two donations. You're gonna love these. Yeah, take it. You're welcome. I have one more. I have a, a Ulysses butterfly. Yeah. Take it. Oh no, no, I'm good. Thank you. I know. I also should buy that book, but uh, all right. We're, we're trying to be. We're trying to be good. We're developing out the farm. So the first stage of that is going to be... Alright. I think I worked out I could have one more pleep, didn't I? Yep. I'll take it. I know, he only has one doggo heart per, doesn't he? I know we'll buy that anyway I'm gonna I'm gonna have like a little horde of dogs I need to actually make a special dog run because I don't think I can have them inside yep I'll give her a home oh well we have Estrella Estrella this one can be Australia <laughs> Someone's going to be mad at me. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's go home. So I've got another ruby to um, to, uh, to to get to purchase as well. Let's grab this. <laughs> we'll we'll go home before I get into trouble for my terrible names. Oh dear, I also need to do my my farming. Oh wow, thank you so much. Hi, Clover. Hello. Oh, little little little. He's a happy little pleep. All right, so I have two pleep and four pleep houses. So we're, we're good. You know what? I'm going to move the bowls and put them over here. You may go in here, little. Yeah, you got friends. <laughs> All right, let's grab that bowl and we'll pop that down before I forget. I know. Whoever, whoever made the sounds for these critters is definitely had far too much fun with it. Let's go with this. All right, and there's going to be a run on the food bowl, so I can see this. Let's go with that. All right, we'll just wait till they empty them, and then I'll move them again. Did you just... 
Go on, eat that one, I dare you. Man. Hungry little beggars. Alright, so now there's now there's enough food for them. They're good. Looks like I need to be putting my corn in. Now someone said uh, that grass seeds were, were better for this because they're renewable. And I think you're right, but... <laughs> but... Alright, first things first. I did not put down my paths. Oh, okay, well, seeing as I'm here, I know, I'm dizzy. So I can buy one more pleep. Uh, and I need to make some chook houses. I'll just pick up the uh, the eggs. Pet the chookers. I know, I'm going to turn my back and those bowls are going to be so empty. No? Pet Shakira, Pet Shakila. Oh, man, I've got to write those names down that were suggested to me because I can't remember them. They were cool though. Trukella, that's it. Alright, I have happy chickens. Let's go feed the bombats. I swear, I'm not sure these big fellas are eating all their stuff. While I'm doing this, my brain, um, my head's just thinking. I'm braining. All right, that's right. I, I wanted to work out how many more pens I could put down here. And I'm thinking one, two, at least another four. So I need four more Vombat pens. Uh, I need another one, two, three. And then we're going to start on this side. Four, five, six more chicken pens. Because I want to be able to make a ton of uh, quiches and things. So, four Vombat pens, six chicken pens, and another three Pleat pens. And I've got to go put that ruby away. Alright, let's go get the ruby. Three Pleat, four, four Vombat, six. Actually, I need to do the chicken pens before I go. Why? Because I need to buy my chickens before Steve closes and I can't do that copper spinifex tin gum and nails without a home copper spinifex tin gum and nails and I'm gonna need that because I'm gonna need more nails all right let's make the nails first Stop at 50 on that. We're going to make six of these, maybe. All right. We're going to go and dump down at least one of them, and then I'm going to come back. Two of them. I need to put down two if I want to buy two chickens. Let's go. Uh, chicken houses. Hello, chicka chicka. I know, I'm going to have to rethink where I've got. in the way there. Oh, okay, spin effects. Alright, we'll come and clear that later. Alrighty, now this is where it gets a bit dicey, because I'm going to be short. I, I thought I had a food bowl crafting recipe, but I don't think I do. Uh, and I forgot to bring my diamond with me, that's a bit silly. Alrighty, I'll grab my chicken, and then I'll go grab my, my, my ruby, and then I'll go grab my other chicken. Hi, Sally! Yep, I'll give her a home. Oh, right, now I need my comment boxes. Give me a minute. Okay. 
So courtesy of Grammy D, we have Chicoletta. All right, now I don't think he's going to let me buy another one. Okay. All right, so we're going to take the boxes, we're going to take them outside first before he'll let us buy another one. But we can just take them outside and, I don't know, drop them in the middle of the path. Don't release them though, otherwise you'd be a sad panda. So that's Chickaletta. And we will buy... I know, I'm really enjoying... <laughs> I'm really enjoying these names too. Chickalotta. So I just have to remember Chickarella for tomorrow. <laughs> All right, let's go. So we're going to grab, uh, we'll grab this one first. I'll just run her home. Man, I hope they, they don't eat them while they're in the box. Let me just alt tab for a minute. Alrighty. My mouse back in the window. Do I have that butterfly? That's another Ulysses, isn't it? Yeah. I know. Sorry. Ooh, I have a baby chicken. Wait, there's a butterfly. Shh. Okay. <laughs> I think I just released a chicken on top of a chook. That was kind of funny. Oh dear. They have lots of grain and stuff to play in. I'm kind of happy with the way that looks. Um, I'm, I'm sort of half thinking I may have to... Um, yeah, I may have to go and... Sally, that's not safe, sweetie. I'm going to have to fence that off just so she doesn't get eaten. Alright, let's get um, Chicoletta home. Chicoletta, Chicoletta, Chicarella. Okay, I've got to remember that one. We can also have Chikora, because I don't think I've got a Chikora. I know, so many chickens. I don't know if this is a good way to have chickens. And, I mean, they eat the minute they arrive, too. There you go, guys. Girls. Okay, that should keep them happy. Uh, we haven't missed John yet. Let's go grab our ruby, now that I'm back here and I'm, I'm thinking. We're braining. Braining, braining, braining. So we've almost finished our uh, our chicken hut. <laughs> chicken hut requires. What I'm actually thinking of doing now is is widening that pen out by one more square. But I mean, it would mean chopping down a lot of fruit trees and you know replanting them. And I'm not sure I want to faff about quite that much. Um, maybe extending it though. Oh, and I've got to do these crafting requests. We'll get those done in a minute as well. Alrighty. Ah, weighs 2.63. Thank you. Alright, no 5 kilo rubies for me, but uh, I'm not going to complain about that level. Now, what was it? what else was in this box? Okay, I emptied the box. John, did I remember to sell you this oval, opal? I don't think I did. Uh, yeah, I've kind of got to talk to you, don't I? I'm sorry. Well, I need to sell you. I need to sell you this. I I'm not sure I want to sell that. I oh, you know what? No, I'm going to hang on to it. I'm going to feed it to the um, the Alpha Devil statue that I've got. We're going to see what happens when, <laughs> when I do that. Oh, dear. Alrighty. Let's just sell that. I can't see anything else here I desperately want to sell. There we go. Yeah, that sounds great. 16 and a half grand. Alright, let's go grab ourselves a mine pass because I haven't done that for a little bit. Yep, I'll take that. Yeah, so I can buy three animals a day, but I can only buy one animal food, uh, one animal feeder a day. So that's, um, and they don't come with feeders. In pumpkin days, they come with their own feeder and you can buy an extra one if you need it, but uh, not here. So. Yeah, gonna have to gonna have to keep an eye on that. Otherwise, we're gonna have to do multiple feedings in a day. Let us, while we are here, maybe pull our weight with our garden so that the townsfolk aren't doing all the work. 
I may have left my watering can in my closet. Well, that's where everyone keeps their watering cans, isn't it? I'm enjoying... Actually, do I have holiday pants in here somewhere? I have jolly pants and holiday shirt. Let's just switch those around. Um, I have a hat. What's this? A green baseball cap and a PI hat. Very nice. Orange flanny dress, a green summer dress and a green flannelette dress. Green summer dress. Well, you know, I'm going through a green phase. All right, let's get those done. Oh, did I remember to pull my watering can after all that? I did. Well, I'm going to leave my... No, I'm going to take my hoe with me because I have a whole other field that I should be paying attention to. Alrighty, let's, uh, let's go with the watering can. Alright, so we've, we've almost completed our, our um, chicken houses. Uh, and then once we do that, we'll get into our vombat pens and, uh, and our pleat pens and we'll finalise those. I know it's the 17th of spring already. I do need to be careful what I plant now. We have about 11 days before. Um... I know, might as well top it up as we go past. I am loving this watering can. There we go. So it's a relatively peaceful day. I know that kangaroo would be right in here if it could. Hi Franklin. <gasps> yes, I, I did just try and water a cement a brick path. What are you what are you trying to say, Franklin? Alrighty, let's get speaking brick paths. I, know, I couldn't really put them down under the well. It got a bit cross when I tried. Okay. So if I'm going to make this path two parts wide and put a fence in. Uh, so what I'm thinking is we might go along here. And then I might actually run it. Run a path this way. Right, so we've got like this brick path surrounding this pond and like it'll be a little bit of a grassy open park area for them. And then we'll run it down this way as well. What's that? Okay, I didn't think that was like any moth I'd ever caught before. <laughs> it's not, it's a butterfly. So yeah, basically we might run... We might run, um, I might run a double path behind these houses to maybe have like a strip of trees and a strip of garden and then two, two strips of path, like a double path, um, and we'll have lighting as well. And then we might hollow, hollow this section out, um, here, 
and put in a couple of benches. Maybe a picnic table if there is one. Maybe a, an outdoor barbie if there is one. And then what I'll do is on the other side of the path, we'll run a fence all the way around it. Hopefully we won't get crocodiles spawning in the billabong. We might, but you know, maybe maybe they'll spawn elsewhere once we've fenced it. So that's that's the thought that I'm having for the development for this area. Uh, and when we get more residents, I'll, I'll take another suggestion that someone made, which was, uh, why don't I put the townhouses a little bit closer to the farm, like gradually build them, build them out towards where I'm at and thus extend the boundaries of the town. I'm thinking that's, that's not that bad an idea. I should probably also pay attention to my chores. I have some stone on me somewhere. Let's uh, grab those out. I need to grind some rocks. I need to go talk to some residents apparently. Let's go do that. Oh no, these are easy little permit points that you can that you can make and I, I tend to just not do them because I get horribly sidetracked on other things. Uh, so I might start doing that. Let's have a chat with Franklin. Hi Franklin. Greetings, let's chat. I have discovered that Solus is not only a great place for research and discovery, but also a generally nice place to live. Whoever has allowed for a place like this to be built is truly very clever. Oh, you need to go and thank um, Fletch for that. It was all Fletch's idea. She recruited me, but she uh, she put the groundwork in. Hey, John. Uh, let's chat. When my brother decided to move my business here, we were taking a pretty big risk. But I'm very glad he made that decision for me. He doesn't know what he's missing here on Solace. <laughs> wow, John, your brother is a piece of work. Let's not tell him what he's missing here on Solace, because I don't want him to come here instead of you. And, and get you stuck in Southern City. I want you to be able to stay here. All oh, right. You know what, though? I think we might let this girl. Um, let's go and have a look at these chook pens. I just want to see if I need to maybe really think about bringing this fence out one more row. You know, I am. I'm thinking we need to. We need to. Um... Yeah, we need to bring this fence out where these bushes are, where I've put all these bushes. And then I need to chop down all these trees and replant them and bring them back a row. Let me just grab my uh, my beehive. Radio. So we need to do that. And I might. All right. So I am going to pop the um this other chicken hut down. So I've got a couple here. I've got one. There you go. Yeah, because I think the chickens need a bit more room, um, basically. Oh, that's right. We worked out I had to I had to chop a few things underneath it, didn't we? There we go. And I had the same problem with this one. Alrighty. Yeah, because once I once I move those those feeders, we're not going to have a lot of space in here at all. So maybe I also need to think about where now we could extend them all the way out to here, but I need to bring this up a level if we do that. Well, that's okay because I wanted to drop I wanted to drop these two layers of fencing here. So that I had a nice solid fence. Although that's that's going to work with that tree there, so I could just leave it. Maybe it's just this layer I want to drop. Yeah, let's do that. And then we want to drop the layer in behind it. So so we'll go and do that. Um. Yeah. Ugh. Why I do this to myself. I'm going to bring that out too, actually. So we're definitely moving those bees. Where is my shovel? Not there. Smart shovel. Alrighty. I kind of know what I'm doing. This is my first really big space for chickens and putting a lot of chickens in one space too. Um, 
How much space in my backpack? Okay, let's deal with that first. I know, I should be selling a bunch of eggs to... Um, to John, just for that particular... I'm, I'm curious about this. Um, for that particular achievement set. I do have corn in here. Radio. One corn for 10 feed. This would give me 300 and... No, 220 feed though. If I can keep on top of it. Uh, and I need to have several going. So we're going to have a massive corn harvest come... Um, is it summer and fall? Or is it fall and winter? One of those. Well, when we can plant our corn. Alright, I needed six chicken huts. I built six chicken huts. And I think I still need two more. Let me just drop this one in. Because I don't know how long it's going to take me to do this. Yeah. I can fit three more. Uh, and we will. It's going to require a little bit of terraforming, but we'll get those done. So three more chicken huts. Four more Vombat Huts and three more Pleep Huts. Alrighty, we got this. Chicken Huts. I can do one more Chicken Hut. I need to go hunt more things. Okay. Vombat. Iron, Spin Effects, Hardwood, Tin and Nails. I didn't milk them too. It's going to be a waste if I do this and not actually do the cropping. And I've forgotten what I needed. Alright, grab my chicken hut. Grab my dog hut. That over. Actually, that's going to go in tools. Along with my chicken hut. Okay. Vombats. Tools. I think we're going to... I might stop at six each. So I've got four huts up. So I need two more vombat huts. I've got four plea pads up. Hearts, hats, hearts. Four leap hearts up. What is that doing in there? Iron bars. Did I use up all my iron bars on those chickens? I think I did. Yeah, I did. My gosh, iron and copper. Okay, so we're going to have to go mining. Oh, how sad. Alright. So that's basically the plan. The plan is just to get uh, everything done. Like, prepped for the animals. And then we're going to just prep for the other bits and bobs. And then we're going to make the town pretty. That's what I want to do. And I don't know. I don't know how long it's going to be before the um, the next update. But it says spring update. So uh, I don't know. Do they mean spring maybe in the northern hemisphere? Ooh. So we definitely need. To, I think we've got enough to keep us busy if that's the case. I need to put those stairs down. All right. We might let this character get some sleep. I know I'm waffling away all her time. Poor girl. Definitely need more of those. All right. So we're nearly done. We're going to get our animal huts done. Then we're going to get our barrels done. And then we're going to get our fertilizer done. All right. I need to maybe just buy animal plates to make sure. Yeah. How far does it need me to go? John. Nice talking to you the other day. Thanks for being a great friend. You're welcome, John. All right, we need to drive a certain distance on our bike, but first we need to make sure our chickens get enough feed because we don't have enough feeders. All right, they, they're okay for the moment. Let's take our bike for a run. We might have to feed these guys in the afternoon. And gals, guys and gals. We need to milk our vombats and we need to do our fuddy ducks. Not 
inside. All right. I'm not sure how far I've got to go. What's that? You popped a mono. I know. I should go and see if the uh, if the emu eggs have if the emu eggs have um. Oh, okay. That's gonna lead me back into the water. I'm lost. That's fine. Oh, sugar. Okay. Don't watch where you're riding, or the the echidna is gonna be really mad at you. Uh, the answer to my question is yes. The emus now have more eggs, and they don't like being. Disturbed. I want to go back and get those there's a piece. Ariel, we're not leaving them. So by the time we um we get home, oh! I know, right? Let's not go in the river again. Oh no 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 no! Okay, we are definitely heading in the wrong direction. the 84th life it gets a little feral <laughs> this is why I don't ride my bike okay guys just because I'm not very good at steering up ah. Ariel Ariel Ar Ariel Ar Ariel no ah stop please wait no oh dear All right, let me just see if I can work out where I am on the map. Okay, so <laughs> I want to go home. I hate these these ride your vehicle things. I should just get into the into the boat and and ride that. It's it's probably safer for everyone if I do, you know, I'm becoming one of those drivers where if you see me driving, it's like quick get up on the footpath. You'd be a lot get get into the middle of the road. You'd be a lot safer there. Oh dear. All right, we've achieved our first our first thing. What's the next thing we had to do, according to our journal chores? Right, we travelled a thousand a kilometre by bike. We need to go buy a new tool and clear thirteen grass. Okay. Where's my where's my thing? Let's go and clear some grass. We need to go clear some grass anyway because uh, I want to put some trees down. Oh, tools. Right, we're going to put our doggo house in the toolbox. Our chicken house in the toolbox. We gotta go mining too, so I gotta go get some more minerals. Uh I'm looking for my scythe. And actually seeing what tool I should buy anyway. So we actually have three axes. We need some more pickaxes. I'm kinda of going through those boys. Yeah. So through the through the pickaxes. Alright, I have one. So I think we need at least one more pickaxe. Put that back. Good for fishing rods, good for bug nets. Okay for shovels. So yeah, let's go get a pickaxe for our tool our tool option. I know. Sometime this year I'll get around to doing what I need to. Do do do. This is why Ariel runs around on foot, because it's safer that way. Okay. Hi, how are you doing, Melvin? That's what we're doing today. We're doing all of these. All right. Because we could, I, I sat down and worked out that we could. What am I doing? I'm buying a tool. What is that? That's blue. 
buy ooh, I'll buy that. A house customization kit. Use it on houses to customize their appearance. Yep, I'll take that. Thank you. Besides the way I'm spending oh and we'll buy another mine pass, because I can always do a despair. Where I'm spending um, dinks, we're going to need to go into the mines anyway, so I think I may need another ruby or five, along with my um, ores. I also, really what's holding us up, we'll take that. Thank you. Alrighty. So we have a pickaxe. We have that. If I have a, um, a vombat in here, we're going to buy the vombat. Yep. So grab that. Her home. Oh, okay. I've got Estrella, Astrella, Australia. This one can be Australia. I oh, know. Doing the, the thing with the animals. Uh, and then the next thing I've got to do is scythe a bunch of grass. We got this. Uh, and maybe water those crops so that they uh, get harvestable. Kind of. Is that a fly? That is possibly a fly. Is this the last bombat that I have a house for? Oh, no, this is why we need stairs. One, two, three, four. Release the wombat. Did I remember to buy her a bowl? I don't think I did. Alrighty. I think the wombat pen is, is definitely big enough. It, it could just be the... It's just the chicken pen. I've got to expand. Yep, I've got to build the ground up for that. Alrighty, that's fine. I will go and get another food bowl though because I don't think I've got a food bowl crafting recipe. Uh, and we need to go and see what uh, good old... What's his face is selling. Franklin. Oh, I know. Shh. And there's, an, uh, there's a chicken whistle there too. Uh, we might just buy the chicken whistle. Just in case they get out. Um, because, you know, last time was a disaster. Alright, we've paid off the town debt. We've bought a chicken whistle. I'm, re I'm refusing to buy chickens just yet. Let's see what seeds we have. Uh, right. So what I'm thinking is, I, okay, I won't do it yet. I was thinking I should probably buy seeds for next season so that I have them on hand. I know, right? I'm gonna leave that blank, so I'll, I'll put a um another block of dirt in there, so that so that we're good. There is a way now to farm grass. Uh, it, I'll get to it. I just haven't gotten to it yet. Ah, uh, yeah. That's going to need to... I'm going to need to dig out this so that um, it runs along here. And we'll just... I know, if I, if I destroy that, I can't move it, so I'm going to have to destroy it. Alrighty. That's fine. Let's pickaxe that up. And drop it all in there. Okay. I know, we're getting there just very, very slowly. Is it as I work out the game and what I want to do with it, um, it'll, it'll get a little bit more coherent. So I'm going to grab my stairs because I could do without them being in here if I can possibly help it. I know I wasn't going to do this yet. So 
we need to make this too wide as well. We might as well do that now while we're here. sure whether I want to um I think what we'll do is we'll do it along this line I'll just see if I can get away with it otherwise I'll be digging all this up again that's okay it brings it right up to the front of this house all right yep yeah, that'll do so now we're double pathed I know, I, that was derpy, wasn't it? Let's try that again. Uh, we are going to put... This will tell me where I want to put the next lot of paths as well. If, I, if I've got stairs but no path. Alright. I know, I forget why I came in here now. That, that's a lot nicer to run on though. And then we narrow it down for my private property so that makes that makes sense. All right so I don't know how far out I'm going to widen this so we'll just leave the rest of it. We'll put these stone steps in the toolbox. I know, before I drop anything out of my backpack, I just want to make sure I've got everything I need. So we've got plantations we need to do. I need to put that food bowl away. I need to go fill the food bowl. So I think the little beggars will have eaten by now. So we'll start over here. Um, we are going to pick up the, these two feeders. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop the feeders a little bit more strategically. We'll pop them over here. I mean, I could probably end up putting more pleat pens down this way, but while we're focused on the other area, we'll, uh, we'll get that done. So basically, I need to fill those, don't I? So basically what we're going to do is... Um, Wait, did I put an extra feeder in here? I did. Ooh, that's okay. Alright, we also need to, before they end up sleeping, so we can't really do this at the end of the day after a day of mining, we actually have to do it sooner, is we need to... Looks like I'm doing a day of maintenance. That's okay. Uh, oh yeah, let's get that chicken whistle out of there. There we go. We need to shear these guys. Otherwise there's waste just having all of these resources sitting around and not um Yeah, you're a good girl. Alright, where's your little fuzzy friend? Oh you're not so fuzzy friend. I can't remember if she's grown up or not. Okay, padded Estrilla. And again, padded Estrilla. Padded Australia. So Est Estrella, Australia, 
and oh fine smart alec peeps i might have to deepen their their water hole actually they look like they really like that deeper water a lot more i'll just start dive down and get rupu i know it's I suspect it's mislabeled bloody duck poo. We'll just grab this fruit because I'm always whining about being short of it. Which means I probably have a day of harvest uh, to do in the in the in the orchard. We'll get that done. I know life of a farmer. I'm not quite sure what she's doing. It looks to me like she's attempting to shear her fruit trees. Ah, no one's told her that's a bad idea, but anyway. Let us wander around and pick up all of these. We'll go put those in the kitchen. And I think next episode we're probably going to take a couple of runs through the mines but I'm going to try and also remember to pick up a, uh, a mine pass. Alrighty a little bit of harvesting to do in here. I've got to really think about where I want to put those creepy statues. I'm actually thinking we can put them in the four parks around town. So if they don't freak the townsfolk out too much, we can have them. We can have them. Um, yeah, have them like on the four corners because I think that that'd be kind of funny. Just to Let's get her to wander through here and make sure she's got nothing else to harvest. Alright, we're going just that one over there. Okay, so we've basically got all of this. I know, bloody ducks are happy. I'm going to have to find out where I've flung all my fruit. Some of it will be up here. Oh, and I've got to do that harvesting. I see you. I know. Child. I do like that idea of grabbing all those eggs and sticking them in a safe spot. I have a mew saddle. I wonder if I'm any worse at riding a mew than I am at stealing, steering a bike. Stealing a bike. Oh my god, I paid for that fair and square. I'll have you know. And there's no auto, th no grand theft auto occurring here. Oh boy. I just can't talk. That's what my problem is. It's not a confession. It's a mispronunciation. Sure, we believe you. still managed to, <laughs> to get itself in between the stairs. Oh my gosh.
let's get these things in. Pick up that gumwood log, I suppose. You know, I forgot to milk my bombats as well before dark, and I have a feeling I can't milk them now. We'll find out. Poor little wombats too. I mean, we're going to be... Let's go and see if we can anyway. There's there's my typical rogue bananas down the pit. pit. Okay. Oh, I can milk. I, I can milk Fazzini. Uh, and I can pet Fazzini. Uh, I can milk Fuzzy. And I can pet Fuzzy. Yes, yeah, sweet dreams, Fuzzy. Oh, I can I can pet little I can't pet little thing of me. No, okay. Let's um let's make sure these guys have and girls have feed. I don't think I fed them properly either this morning. So someone is hungry. Pet fluffy. Oh I'm not sure I can milk oh I definitely can't milk fluffy with a bag of chicken feed, can I? And milk fluffy. And pet fluffy again. Yes, you are a good fluffy. I know, I'm always whining about not having enough bananas. Well, time I made sure I, I didn't have to worry about that. You know what? I haven't actually gone way up north and looked for coconut trees uh, with coconuts on them. I'm not sure that happens in spring though. I think I'm probably going to have to wait till summer, maybe. I should sort of check them though. They're out on the islands and I have no excuse not to go now because I have a, um, I have a boat, right? Alright, all of that's done. Man, I don't think these chickens are ever quiet when they're babies. All right, they're probably also not quiet when they're hungry. Let's um, let's deal with that. So I've now got seven chickens and uh, five bowls. We're going to have to deal with that. There goes Chickaletta. She's hungry. This is why they're making all the noise because they're hungry. So we'll, uh, we'll go and we'll come back in a minute and we'll feed, fill those feeders again. I know it's getting it's getting fairly late. All right, that I think is all of our fruit picking uh, homework done. Maybe we we'll just grab these rogue bananas. Be sure there was another one. That was a bush lime. All right, so very soon I should have the. Um, Get this this making more that up. Okay. I know I need to get that silo in as well, but for that we need again, like with everything else, we're gonna need a ton of metal. So okay. I have one. I needed what two or three more of these. Yeah, so we're gonna need what four. So four fives are twenty. Uh, three fives are fifteen. Okay, so enough for forty. So we're going to need forty um, 
copper ores and 15 just to finish those two uh, three okay then we need to look at our windmill which I need to have an area for so all right barrels or kegs sorry we need 15 ores a piece so I'm gonna need 150 ores a piece and we're gonna need 100 palmwood planks Whew. I know we got our work cut out for us okay let's just grab everything out of our pack so we're semi ready for tomorrow uh, yep. How are we? For, we're good for fruit salad, so I don't need to really spend a lot of time with them. I do have flour. Do I have sugar? Not yet. I didn't water my crops. All right, you know what we're going to do? Tomorrow, we start out. So I've got my crock meat on me. I only have... Right. Oh, okay. I need to cook that. Okay, I have 31 cooked croco meat. So what I think I might do, I just need to grab my scythe, so I don't think I've done that yet. Okay, I must have put it in here then. Yeah. We'll just finish that last task up. So we're going to grab our scythe, we're going to do that task, and then we're going to go and head on over to the... Um, the garden and finish the watering that we haven't done there and on the way to the mines we'll drop everything else off that I've currently forgotten to drop off because because we can all right we did do our scything radio let's not scythe any of these let's just get our watering can done we'll fill that up Looks like I've got a bunch of stuff growing, so. I know, there's, there's part of me, it's like, well, there's too much to do. It's all right, you've got it. <laughs> Easy, Ariel, it's going to work. It'll all be okay. have days where you just want someone to say it's going to be okay and you want to be able to know that they're right yeah wow you're up late rain thank you I know I don't think there's a gifting system um in this game yet Otherwise, I'd be like wanting to give her presents to say thank you for everything she's done. Because she does a whole lot for us. It's beautiful. Alright, I'm going to water these anyway. They probably don't need it because they're ripe. Hi! <laughs> Hey Ariel Blue, I like have a gift for you. It's my plant book. I've been adding information to it like my whole life. You can probably use it some inf to get some information on any plants you're growing. Oh, don't worry about me. I think you'll like get more use out of it, to be honest. Anyway, I've got all the info here. Wow, rain. Thank you so much. Uh, Alright, we'll just finish that one over there. Oh man, thanks Franklin. Oh, and Sally. Hey Sally. Never enough time in the day, is there? No, what's new? Hey Ari Blue, I was thinking about taking on an apprentice. Maybe they could teach me a thing or two? Maybe. Or you could teach them, so. What do you reckon? Oh wait, did I just water your patch? I did. Alright, alright, I'll get out from under your feet. There you go, girl. Man, I think that was a filthy look I just got shot.
I actually like watering with these guys around. Yep. Oh, hi there, Ariel Blue. Do you like me, Desi? Just chatting. I like, have a confession to make. I didn't have a farming license until recently. I like, didn't even know it was a thing I needed. I was like, growing plants illegally, I guess. Mate, you're doing a great job. Who else would I get my seeds from to grow them legally? Alrighty. I think, though, on that note, guys, we are going to go. I'm going to pop my watering can in here. And my scythe. Because confusion is my friend. We're going to put our hoe in here. So our, our um, farming gear is here. I'm going to stick my seeds in here as well. So at least I'll know where they are. Kind of. Maybe sort of if I'm lucky. I'm not sure what to do with this alpha eye. From the, <laughs> from the alpha devil. I'm a little bit scared of it. Oh, we'll be fine. I'll, I'll take a lot of this stuff back. We might sell our bugs to um, John and pick up another mining pass in the morning. And then I think what we'll do is we're going to head into the mine. I'm going to grab this house customization kit. I'm going to stick that down here with my shoes. Land book. That can go right next to the farm. I wonder if I can put it on a dresser. Do I have a dresser I can put it on? No, maybe I can put it... Can I put it on this seat? It's no real placement. No, I can only drop it. Let's not drop it. All right, let's <clears throat> let's put it away. I think we just need to pop it away. There we go. Boom. A wooden couch. I think I probably need to sell that one too. Let's get some sleep. We need a rug in there or two. Alrighty. Check you later, guys.